But first, our Alex Elich is live outside of Wrigley Field. Alex, millions are expected to take part in the celebrations. You guys, right now I'm in the midst of the crowd where a party more than 108 years in the making is about to get started. You can see here there are already thousands of people lining up to see the parade. This parade is expected to have more than 2 million people. Now that was the count of the Blackhawks parade. But I mean, check it out right now. You guys can see thousands of people here to check this parade route out. So the team lives here at Wrigley Field at 11 o'clock South Bend time, then travels to the start of the parade route at Michigan Avenue and Oak Street at noon Eastern time. Now, the parade will then travel along Michigan Avenue between Oak Street and Ohio Street, and then along Columbus Drive between Monroe Street and Balboa Avenue. So, if you want to catch the parade, you're encouraged to watch it right along that route. The team's scheduled to arrive at Hutchinson Field in Grant Park around 1 o'clock Eastern time. Now, if you do plan on coming to the parade in Chicago, there's no fee to get in, but you can expect to go through a lot of security checks and expect a lot of traffic. So, come here now, get your spot, and claim your territory. Now, if you're not coming to Chicago, there's also going to be a watch party happening at Four Winds Field, and they'll have the den open with all their World Series gear to claim there, too. And right now, the Chicago River is being dyed cubby blue. So a lot going on here today. We're going to be on scene all morning, and WSBT 22's Caitlin Conant is going to be having team coverage of the parade. So we'll keep you guys updated all day long. Live in Chicago, I'm Alex Elich, WSBT 22 News.